My name is Oliver Boucher, I'm the Chief Business Officer at Vivacta and I'm going to be talking about personalised medicine and some of the new developments that we believe the technology our company is developing will bring to this space. Now personalised medicine is known by the mantra of the right drug for the right patient at the right time and what we're interested in doing is adding to that and talking about the right dose and the right outcome. What my company is developing is a new technology using immunoassay on a revolutionary new sensor platform which allows, among other things, small and large molecules to be detected using a point of care system using a single 30 microliter drop of whole blood. What this technology allows is for the user of the instrument to determine in real time in tests that take uh, less than 10 minutes in terms of the time from sampling to result to have an understanding of the drug levels in the blood uh, immediately or at any chosen time after the drug is administered and in parallel with that information that essentially pharmacokinetic information the patient or the user be it a doctor or a nurse of the instrument can also measure the response to that particular drug, which may be a biomarker of effect, a, a kind of pharmacodynamic marker, or it could be a marker of toxicity. Now with this combined set of data, it's possible for the patient or for the user or his or her physician to modify the dose and therefore to personalize the way in which treatment is delivered, the way in which pharmaceutical treatment is delivered. This personalizing of pharmaceutical care is expected to be the next revolution in personalized medicine and takes the field away from its origins in pharmacogenomics, which are largely the basis of the current screening attempts to predetermine a patient's predisposition to a particular drug. So it's a movement away from predisposition testing from screening patients to see whether they will respond and predict their response to actual determination of outcome. And it's outcome, after all, which the payers, the reimbursement agencies, are seeking to uh, establish before they pay for the drugs. We believe this uh, development will combine to take the pharmaceutical industry from a a mission of selling drugs, of selling medicines, to one in which they will be selling outcomes. And the sort of technology that we are bringing to the marketplace will facilitate this development.